was still hoping that Natsu get some sort of like dragon scales too, but maybe this is too early in the show for that. Or maybe even alone. I don't know if the show would ever do something like that. <sighs> and all of this just from getting some fire? Damn. <laughs> Dude. Keep punching him! He deserves to pull his hair! Likes to beat up girls! Yo, it's not over! Go keep beating up Kajio! <laughs> I want to see blood! Why are they smiling? She just said they're awesome! Wait, what? Wait, this whole time Ursa and this schmuck were fighting! What an unruly drag. But he's also oh an my god, Mira, Jay! Do something. In fact, you're the first wizard who's ever been able to lash this long against me in battle. We'd be more equally matched in power if you hadn't taken the direct Ooh, hit. Ooh, interesting. Heal her up! Get a fair fight, asshole! The fact that there are so many powerful wizards like yourself. What is your problem with him? Battle, there's only one way to change that. What is wrong with you? Like, this guy's making this extremely personal. His children dead and gone. He'd be lost. Completely consumed by some. Nah, I doubt it. He's gonna come back to kick your ass. I'll torture him until he has no choice but to willingly huh? die. We have the most powerful wizard with the strongest. Um, we also have more capital and more members than any what? guild. However, recently Fairy Tail has begun to catch up, and our position as leader is in jeopardy. Urza, Locks, a Sadistic, and became widely known. Oh. And stories of Salamander spread across the land like wildfire. So you're just now jelly. And Fairy Tail are considered equals. The so that's why he attacked them. So we're fighting for our lives just because you've had a bit of jealousy? Yeah. Jealousy? That's absurd. We are the dominant. Well, that's not how you do it! Reason, and for such a petty reason! <laughs> Baby girl. You're just swinging at the air, man. You can't even keep up. It sucks. Oh, what the hell is that? We're hired by the patriarch of the Hartphilia family to fight. Okay, I understood that part. So Makara's trying to buy his way to the top. Oh, no, he's not! That is, if we don't completely wipe you out first. I don't like this guy. I'm even more amused by how incredibly misinformed you are about Lucy. Huh? What? She rents a place for 70,000 jewel a month. Oh, right, right, right. She fights alongside us. She laughs with us and she cries with us. She's no different than any other member of yeah. the guild. She don't care about the bodies. She may be the daughter of the Hartphilia family, but just as flowers don't get to choose what oh, they love, indeed, don't oh, get that to is so sad. Well, little Natsu and all the little fairytale kills were all having fun. Shit, little Lucy was bored. She had no one. I'll make her my prisoner until her father moves uh. like a man. I'm going to bleed the uh. Hartphilia family of their fortune and their. Okay. He he's just mad. I'd rather die than cause my killmates to surrender. Dude, I really hope that this doesn't cause too much damage for Ursa. She is killing herself. What are you doing? Go! Not literally! Don't you dare! Fair character! Huh? You were gonna stab yourself. Why? <gasps> oh my god! Okay, it was pretty obvious Daddy was gonna come. But Daddy is here! 
much, but we didn't see that much blood, but it's okay. <laughs> He's got a big ass head <laughs> for such a small dude. Whoa. <laughs> In order to save my guild, I will gladly take that risk. And look, other grandma lady, whoever she is. I can feel that. Why didn't you come and help? The trees. You never listen to me. Okay. And who is this? The Akoski? You're in the wrong show! What are you doing? Itachi, is that you? <laughs> Isn't this supposed to be missed again? Um... What is that? Phantom's flags. There's so uh -huh. many. He must have overthrown every single one of their branches in the kingdom. Take another apple for uh, what? Are going to pick up this mess you made yeah, motherfucker, you just littered. <laughs> what? This guy is confusing. Why did you go help your homies? Ugh. I'm also curious how long Mystigan has been a fairy tale member. I feel like I already know this answer. But I might have forgot what it is. Yo, I want to see this so bad. And it, it hurts me so much to know how amazing Fairytale is and the lack of video games. Why is it Fairytale got a shitload of video games? The fuck, man? Rant over. <laughs> six years? Huh. You all be proud that you are members of Oh my god! Yo! Oh! <laughs> My dude can barely even walk. He ain't okay. Whoa! What? Are Yo! Those are some fancy words, and I'm on your side. So you want me to concede? Kneel before side. <laughs> He's even gouging! Oh my god, dude! Yo, he is serious. He said, "Deal, bitch." So he gave you fair warning, motherfucker. He gave you out of fair warning. Yo, what is he gonna do? What? It's just fairy law. What is this? He just summoned Jesus! What is going on? Where's the light coming from? Oh, it destroys darkness or whatever, maybe, huh? They're disappearing! Huh. What is that? A spell that vanquishes darkness with sacred okay. light. It only affects those who the caster sees as their Ooh. enemy. Oh, it was just a... Uh... Bundle of light? Yeah, look, he has white hair. Hey, your mustache white too! Oh my god! <laughs> oh! Woo! I'm sure the Magic Council will be watching us after all the chaos we've caused. You better be on your best behavior. Really? No! I know I will. The old man slept himself open again. This is my chance! I was just about to say, I know Macroff senses him. I'll wipe out your entire guild without What do you hesitation. mean you will? Now you kids get out. You should take Jose. Alright, cool, yay, we did it, but no! No, there's no time for celebration! Those motherfuckers deserve more punishment! Destroy their guild! And then like yo, make him change their name! To like Fairytale Guild Z or something. They, they're not even allowed to be called Phantom Lords. Fuck! You can't give him a slap on the wrist. There's consequences. Look, that guy got. Look, he got a broken arm. I don't know. 
a part of me is like, all right, cool, yay, the episode's over, or at least the uh, arc is over, so we can move on to something else. But then also another part of me is like, oh, that was extremely anticlimactic. It's like I don't really know how to feel. Like, like I'm happy that a lot of these shows, like Seven Deadly Sins, My Hero Academia, Fairy Tale, they know how to start an arc or start a situation and just end it in the next episode. We don't have to dilly dally for five episodes of speeches and backstory just to get a quick fight. I like how hey, we create the event, the next episode. That event happens. You don't have to worry about a shitload of episodes. I appreciate that. But a part of me is like, eh, I really wanted something more. You know, it's like, eh. Where, then again, it's like I'm thinking, yeah, that's another cool thing for a show to do. Because if it leaves you with longing, if it makes you feel like you want more, then the show is doing it right. So, I don't know. I don't know how I feel right now. I'm very conflicted. It's not like I hated the episode. It's not like... I didn't enjoy it, it's just, I'm like in between here. So pretty much in today's episode, we got at the end of Gajil and Natsu, and you know, Natsu pretty much hammered him down, destroyed the motherfucker. I just, I want Gajil to get even a better punishment, because what he did was fucked up. What he did to Levy and her friends, what he did to Lucy, you know, beating her up, pulling her hair, that was fucked up. By, you know, brutalizing the fairy tale guild. That was fucked up. So, I don't want some slap on the wrist kind of bullshit. He, he did some bad things. There's just no, no redeeming him. So, I want more punishment on him. Another thing that happened in today's episode, uh, was, uh, finally the fight between Jose and Makarov. I love how Makarov, oh, he was so angry. I love how he, <laughs> he pretty much told Jose, like, motherfucker, I'm gonna count to three. You better freaking kneel to me or you go, you go learn today. And Makarov did some, uh, weird fairy law attack. I guess it was some blinding lights of holiness thing. Maybe, I don't know. He summoned Jesus. Uh, it, it was, it was okay, I guess. I, I just wanted to see, uh, a more brutalization of a fight between them. But I guess this also works too in a way to be able to defeat uh, the baddie with one attack, with one massive holy attack, right? Because uh, it shows the level of how powerful Makarov is. Like, like we're supposed to put it in the same line. Like Makarov is over here, and the kid characters are still down here. I don't know. It makes sense to me, but I don't know. I just I want it more. <laughs> so now, what really happens next, right? Uh. I didn't like how Makarov just left Jose to be like, all right, dude, uh, just leave us alone. Just go on to your own vices. I don't like that because it's like, yo, <laughs> you do bad things, you know, there should be repercussions. You know, go to prison, lose your magic or something, right? I don't like how you attack the fairytale guild, you attack the members, you hurt them, you victimize them, you did a lot, and then you're just going to be like, all right, deuces, you know, no, it doesn't work that way, you know, where is the punishment, where is the karma, where's the consequences, you know, that doesn't work for me, so I hope that in later episodes we get to hear something of that, like the magic console disbanding, you know, the phantom lord, which is something that I kind of expect to see, like there's no way that the phantom lords are going to be allowed to still be a guild, I really hope that uh, Jose loses ability, the, what about the crying dude guy, he's still, like, out there, and even more, like, Juvia, uh, I'm sure she's gonna, like, show up eventually, I can, I can see her joining the Fairytale Guild, uh, cause her affection for Grey. Also, in today's episode, we got to see Mist again, again, Madavaga is extremely mysterious, you know, uh, we got to see that he did help out the Fairytale Guild in a way, he, he went to other Phantom Lord branches, I guess, or something like that, right? And then he beat all of them up. Like, yo, motherfucker did some work. But why did he come and help them in the real fight? I don't know. He's so weird. We did get to see Laxus, uh looking off in the distance like, motherfucker, you ain't shit. <laughs> so I am extremely hyped for the aftermath, you know, um, at least... 
I can at least uh, assume and guess that the next episode is just going to be like a breather. Like, yo, we saw a lot of action. The characters need to heal and kind of like, you know, <laughs> just, I don't know, put on some Netflix, get some popcorn, you know, because they just went through some hell. Maybe after one episode or so, we'll jump into a newer arc, which no idea where the show can go. We're not getting any closer to Natsu fighting, fighting, finding his dragon pal father thing. Will we get to know more about Lucy's parents? Or is that something that we, you know, again, further episodes down, we'll get to learn more about them? I don't know. I don't know. All right. So that about wraps up in today's episode. Make sure you leave me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video or subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. And as always, God bless you. Thanks so much for watching and for a while for now. Bye-bye.